Good evening. <coughs> Welcome to another video. Hello guys, how are we doing? Tonight, and because it's dark, I'm going to be looking at another through night torch. Let's have a look in the box. Right, nice presentation as per usual. What we've got, nice little torch there. Um, it's a bit of foam. What else have we got? Our instructions. Um, oh, a couple of few extra bits of instructions. Um, we've got um, silica gel, which we're not going to eat. <laughs> and, um, and a little lanyard as well. Right, let's have a look at the torch. Oh, that's quite nice, isn't it? I like that. This is a double A torch, this one. Um, it doesn't take USB. Um, you just unscrew the cap at this end um, and insert the batteries. Uh, if you can see there, we've got, uh, we've got a power button on that end. And um, we've also got our other button there, which is to uh, cycle through the various modes. Um, got a little clip as well, so you can clip it onto something. And um, I thought when I first looked at this, um, I thought I thought this bit slid in and out. <laughs> oh, well, when you look at it, that's what it looked like. It looked like it was it was an extendable one. I thought, oh, how does that work? And then I realised it wasn't. It's, um, it's not extendable. But it is nice. I like that. It's quite a nice torch. It's got um, it's got some holes, obviously, in the end, so you can put the lanyard in it. Um, there we are. If you can unscrew unscrew that end, and then obviously you've got your um, two two AA batteries in there. Pretty solid as usual. Right, we've got our see that's our moonlight setting I believe it's a moonlight let's have a look firefly they've called that I thought it was moonlight setting but maybe that was another manufacturer so sorry <laughs> that's firefly which is um the lowest setting apparently that lasts for 15 days which is good and then we've got um so so basically that power button is on and off basically just on and off that one then we've got our uh, and obviously we've got our cycle button there to uh, cycle through so we've got firefly then we've got low that is this is 51 hours on this power and then we've got medium, which is that one. That is 11 hours. And then we've got full power. That's obviously a strobe. And that's full power. And that is 200 seconds plus 120 minutes. Oh yes, it goes into um, 500 lumens. It's initial. The initial push, first put on is 500 lumens, and then that drops down to 280. So uh, when you initially turn it on, like so, you get the full 500. I think. I think that's how it works. It's waterproof to two meters as well, and um, impact resistant to a meter. So uh, that's pretty good. Um, that's pretty similar to the other one, actually, the one I did last time, which was the um, the USB chargeable one that had the uh, 18650 battery, if you can remember. So, um, 
and that's back that's the fire firefly again that's the t that's tends to be the one that I use the most actually um, yeah it's ideal J like in a tent or something like that just to be able to see what you want in a small area um, yes quite a nice torch um, I must admit I would have quite liked something magnetic on here um, I found that now that a lot of the torches that I use I'm I do prefer the ones that have the uh, the rechargeable ones that you can charge and um, I like them to have a magnet in so that you can actually mount it onto something which I find quite useful I guess you could I, I guess with this you could um, you could just put a clamp around there and you could use it for your bike or something like that or you could have it on some sort of magnetic mount and then clip that onto something so um, nothing's impossible I suppose you could do whatever you wanted to really but um, I do I, I must admit I do wish it, it sort of came with some sort of magnetic mount I think that with quite a lot of torches I find the magnetic mounts very useful but obviously not all torches come with that I like the idea of this bit here that you could use that as a mounting option into something you know maybe like um, like a cycle light or something actually you could use it on a camera couldn't you, you could, if you had your um, is it the magic arm you could use um, Actually, might be a bit bright, mightn't it? Would that be? How would fill? Would that be? How would that fill in? That's the firefly. Let's try. Yeah. As you can see, the spread is—it's quite small. It's got quite a small footprint, so it's not a massively wide one, as you can see there. Well, if I if I turn the light out. So you can see that, look. I've only got the uh, the video light on the top of the camera, but as you can see, it's quite a small pattern. So it's um, it's good for just small areas and that really. That's a little sort of a pocket torch really. Not massively powerful, but it, it's all right, it's ideal. You know, if you just want something just to sort of um, maybe put in a toolbox or something, um, just just to light up small areas or even if you're just taking your dog for a walk you don't need a massively powerful torch then um, I think this could be actually be very useful actually and the fact that it takes double A's I was saying that I did prefer the USB ones but the problem with them is if they do go flat you obviously need USB to be able to charge them up and if you're out in the middle of nowhere and you don't have USB um, obviously you can't charge it but if you do have a spare set of AA batteries you can just swap them over and just put a new set of batteries in which, um, which is pretty good I guess if you're walking or something and you could just pop into a shop get a couple of AA batteries which are widely available and then um, and then just swap them out for the old ones and then obviously you've got your torch again so uh, I guess that could be quite a good idea really anyway that's it um, as you can see nice little torch um, if you want to get yourself one of these um, I'll leave it in the description down below anyway um, yeah, that's another vid so love and light guys have a great rest of the day and uh, love and light to everybody and uh, I'll see you in the next vid Thank you.